Belém is a district located in the western part of Lisbon, Portugal, which offers various sites. Typically, it takes around 15 to 20 minutes by car or public transportation to travel between the city centre of Lisbon and Belém. Our first stop is Jerónimos Monastery or the Monasterio dos Jerónimos, which is a magnificent testament to Portugal's rich history and architectural prowess. This grand edifice, which has stood the test of time for over five centuries, is a true jewel in the crown of Portuguese cultural heritage. The monastery, which was built during the height of Portugal's Golden Age, is a masterpiece of Manueline architecture, a style unique to Portugal. Commissioned by King Manuel I in the early 16th century, this UNESCO World Heritage Site is an embodiment of the nation's wealth and power during the Age of Exploration. It was constructed with riches brought in from newly discovered lands, including Africa, India and Brazil. The intricate and ornate façade of the monastery is a sight to behold. It is adorned with an array of maritime motifs, such as ropes, anchors and seashells, signifying Portugal's prowess in navigation. The monastery's cloisters are an exemplar of Manuline architecture, characterised by its intricate lace-like stonework and imaginative decoration. The delicate details and rich symbolism in the architecture evoke a sense of wonder. Within the Euronymous Monastery, one finds the Church of Santa Maria, an integral part of the complex. Its grandeur is enhanced by the slender columns, towering vaulted ceilings, and magnificent stained glass windows that allow a soft ethereal light to filter through, creating a serene atmosphere. The tomb of Vasco da Gama, the famous Portuguese explorer who opened the sea route to India, is housed here, and it's a testament of the historical significance of the site. The monastery was initially inhabited by Hieronymite monks who dedicated their lives to prayer and meditation. Their devotion to seafarers and explorers earned them the title of protectors of sailors, and the monastery was often a departure point for those embarking on daring voyages. Over the centuries, the Euronymous Monastery has borne witness to numerous historical events, including the 1755 earthquake that ravaged Lisbon. Although the monastery was damaged, much of its intricate stonework survived the devastation, testifying to its enduring strength and resilience. Strolling along the riverfront, you'll encounter the Monument to the Discoveries, a grand tribute to Portugal's explorers. This colossal monument features towering statues of key figures from Portugal's Age of Exploration, including Henry the Navigator at the forefront. Just a stone's throw away is the iconic Belém Tower, a UNESCO World Heritage Site built in the early 16th century. This fortress once guarded the entrance to Lisbon's harbour. Its intricate Manuline-style architecture, with maritime motives and turrets, tells the story of Portugal's age of exploration. After soaking up the local history, satisfy your taste buds at Pastéis de Belém. This renowned bakery has been serving the world-famous custard tarts known as Pastéis de Nata for over a century. The secret recipe is closely guarded, and the results are nothing short of heavenly. If you enjoyed this video, please click the like button and subscribe to our channel.